Hi everybody, it's Nicole Cato here from Austin, Texas, Fru Fru Skin, and I'm actually coming to you from my home in Leander, Texas. And today is Thursday, so this would technically be day four of the peel. And last night, I started to peel more. Now normally, if you had this peel, you would not be flaking this much because I would give you post care to apply to your face to avoid all of the sheets of dead skin showing up. But I wanted to leave it just peeling on my face like a lizard for you so you could actually see what it's doing. And remember, I scaled back on this mid-depth peel, but my skin is more sensitive and it's just so great to know that with this peel, everyone will have a good response from it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you what I should have done on day two is a good oil cleanse. So I'm gonna use some of the citrus gel cleanser and this has a little shea butter in it, which is really great. But then I'm also gonna add another product that I don't retail, but it's from Herbivore. It's the Phoenix oil. It's hard to see. Okay, there we go. So I'm gonna add a few drops of this. Now you can use jojoba oil from Inventive. You can use grapeseed serum, whatever you have at home, Infuse 7. All of those are really great oils that you can use to cleanse. So I'm gonna go in here and wash. Oh my gosh, I can already feel just like dead skin coming off like a snake. Now right there, that's unfortunate because I extracted, I couldn't help myself. So do not pick your skin at home. Let your esthetician like me do it. And that's just from my cycle and the stress of the unknown, but that's life. Everything is unknown. And we just have to take one day at a time. That's, that's all we can do. Jesus said, do not worry about tomorrow, about what clothes to wear, about food you're going to eat because the birds are provided for, so won't we be provided for even more? We don't see the birds stressing out right now. So I add a little bit more of that oil and just do your good cleanse using a good massage pressure to stimulate blood flow, oxygenate the cells. And what's happening is it's emulsifying. It's gathering up all that flakiness. My fingers are really the best tool. I mean, I know a clear sonic brush would work great too, but there's nothing like the human touch. And then you can get a washcloth. I didn't totally have mine prepared here. And you can just go in and take off all that dead skin in a circular motion, or you can work upwards. Another thing that you can do is you can actually put the cleanser and the oil on the cloth as well. Now that stain you see on the cloth, that's from that Phoenix oil that I had applied. It has an amber tint. So no, my skin is not that dirty, but I definitely see a lot of dead skin here. Does it feel sensitive? Not really. I mean, it's, it's definitely brightening up as you can see, but now look. See, I gathered all that dead skin and now I have new skin. Now you can see my discoloration here from broken capillaries and hormones in here, but it is all around lighter. And all this, this will heal in the next few days. I'll do a little follow-up so you can see how amazing it will actually look. Okay, so now let's use a little bit of the Hydrobalance Tonic. Very cleansing, has that witch hazel, comfrey, chamomile, aloe vera. And the witch hazel can sometimes feel a little intense, but that's why you have to shake up your bottle. Yeah, it's feeling tingly everywhere, but I like it. It feels super clean. And then, what do you guys have at home? I have lots of stuff, but I have that blush wine gel, again, that I will use from Rhonda Allison. Just put a couple little pumps in there, small piece size. 
and that'll help with antioxidants to protect the skin from the sun. I oh, know, a little light came off. Doesn't look as good, right? <laughs> and then I have the SkinCeuticals HA Intensifier. That's just pure hyaluronic acid. It's good for stimulating collagen, rejuvenation, and it's hydrating. It's more of a gel. So I'm adding that to the little mix here. And then Phytocorrective Gel is also lightening. It's very soothing too. This is my big back bar bottle. But I sell this Phyto Plus, it's that green serum. So I'm just gonna add a, about three drops of that. Look at that pretty concoction. And then I'll probably send you home with some Calming Skin Gel or Growth Factor Gel. This is Rhonda Allison Sensitive Skin Complex. Just a little pump of that will do you. And then with your little, what would you say, palette, you just mix it all together and rub it into the skin. I'm just gonna put a little layer on. And if you have a guasa, a jade roller, I have ice rollers, you can always do this. Oh my gosh, it's so cold. Or you can just massage it with your hands. I mean, you don't have to be so fancy about it. But if you have the tools, how great is that? And I can always order these for you from Rhonda Allison, the ice rollers. I'm guessing they retail about $30 to $40. I don't know if that's one roller or two, but I have two here. And you really just need one. You don't need to order two, but it's fun for two. And I've done this before on your facial, I'm sure, with my ice rollers at the office. Really get under that chin there. Work to stimulate lymph system towards the temples in an upward motion. Wow, what a difference it's already making. Now that spot, that's just sad. But everything else looks incredible. It's just so much lighter, clearer. There's no more dead skin. See, I got it all off. So you could do that by, once you start peeling on day two, you could do that at home and then you won't be walking around looking like a lizard. So you can go on to whatever events you have, like curbside delivery right now. That's a big event <laughs> I'm gonna dress up for today or walking six feet apart from a person on a trail with your kids, avoiding the playground. That's another event to look great for. Um, now, after all of this, I'm gonna add a little bit of this lapis oil. This is another great oil from this line I like, Herbivore. It's so healing and a little goes a really long way. And then after this, I would definitely recommend some sunblock. I'm gonna put mine on before we head outside, 30 minutes before. I'm using Super Goop right now, the super lightweight one, but I sell SkinCeuticals and their technology is amazing. They paired up with La Roche de Posay and they have some really great mineral-based sun protection ingredients. So you're not getting any of the parabens. Okay, thank you for tuning in. I miss you all. I was so grateful to get to talk to some of you today through text, email, and even the phone all the way from Naples, Florida. That was such a gift. I think we're all getting antsy. We're ready to go out and play when the time is right. And if you need any products, if you have any questions, please reach out to me. You can go to our website, foofreeskin.com. You can book appointments, you can email me, and I'll be happy to ship you out products if you're needing some. Okay, well, I hope you book a melanin lift maybe when you get back, and I'd love to help you with your skin. God bless, and have a great day.